Hey everybody, Scott Sprunta here, DocSports.com, with our week four free pick from the XFL. We've got a great run to start the XFL season. We are 75% six and two with our premium and free picks combined. And right now for Saturday, go over there and grab my XFL picks and you will get my multiple game card all in one package for the entire week and as normal. And the package will be posted in the XFL by 11.30 a.m. Eastern, 8.30 a.m. Pacific, anytime after that over at DocSports.com. And uh, also wanted to mention, don't miss out on a college basketball card. We're on a red hot 67% run. In fact, the last 24 all sports plays were 67%. I've got a seven star play, top play in a multi game college basketball card on Saturday. It will be available also at 11:30 a.m. Eastern, 8:30 a.m. Pacific. NBA, NHL, 1 p.m. Eastern. My UFC is available right now. We've picked up over 23 units with our last four fight cards. So be sure to go grab that. All right, uh, we'll get to the free pick now in the XFL again. It, this is going to be up for the entire week in this game goes on Sunday and it is the battle and I'm going to get you the uh, total right now as we speak but the battle between DC and, and Tampa Bay the game in Tampa Bay that's the late game on Sunday by the way total sitting at 44 44 and a half right around there and I think we're going to see an under again you know about the league man it's eight and one to the under when Houston is not involved but I'm looking at this game and I saw what happened to Cardale Jones last week I, I don't think he's going to be able I don't think he's going to throw four picks and no touchdowns in this game and have a 20.7 quarterback rating like last Last week but he was kind of exposed they mixed things up in LA Tampa Bay can certainly do that uh, what DC did well last week and I expect them to really build on that and get this game off to this kind of a start is run the football quite a bit same thing for Tampa Bay they can't afford to have weak quarterback play cost them again and now they lost Quentin Flowers who says he doesn't want to play for Tampa Bay anymore so I think you're going to see a close to the cuff game I think you're going to see both teams looking to establish the run and keeping it that way throughout the course of the game and I'd like it to stay under 44 44 and a half. So there you go. The under between DC and Tampa Bay, the late game in Sunday's XFL. Be sure to go grab my entire weekend of action. 12 and 2 last weekend with our premium picks in all sports. Let's rack it up and do it again this weekend, Saturday and Sunday. Again, the under between DC and Tampa Bay, my free pick in this week's F XFL. Let's put it in the win column and we'll be right back here next week, next Saturday morning with another free pick from what will be week five in the XFL.